Hello friends, this video on areas of parallelogram and triangles part 10 is brought to you by examfear.com. No, no, fear from exam. A village Itwari is a plot of the land of the sheep of a cordillac. The Gram Panchayat of the village decided to take some of the portion of his plot from one corner to construct a health care. So from one corner, create land to construct a health care. The person agrees to their work proposal with the condition that he should be given an equal amount of land in the lieu of his adjoining, in the lieu of his adjoining his plot, so as to form a triangular plot. So what he is telling is he will give he will give some piece of land, but he want some piece of land somewhere adjoining here, 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 or here. Is adjoining his piece of land so that the, his plot becomes triangular. So, what and how can we propose this? Let's try to make his plot triangular. So, we have two sides and let's try to make this land triangular by just adding this here. So, okay. so you see now the black portion is the The new area. Okay. This is a triangle. So to make this triangle, to make this happen, what he has done is he has given this portion and he has got this portion. Correct. But the area has to be same now. So if if let's be plot oops, no A, B, C, D, let this plot be A, B, C, D, and let B be the new point here. So if we Get B. If you get this, it will be O. So if you get this E O A, and if you give D O C, right, he can get triangle. But in that case, the area has to be same. Correct. So he has to get this piece of land and he has to give this piece of land and we have to make sure that the area of DOC should be equal to area of DOA so that the proposal is uh, hold to so in this case this DOC will be used to build healthcare to build healthcare is medical hospital and EOA trial that the farmer will get and its area is adjoining his land and with this his new land will be CEB. This new total okay. this can be done right but then to make sure that any of these is equal to any of these. So to do this, that these two areas are same, what can be done is because this E point, you can mark E as here or you can mark E as here also, right? Just need to be the E point. You can mark E here also. So there has to be correct point of E. Right? Because if you mark E as here, the formula will get more area. If you mark E as further here, you will get more area. On E as this point, the formula will get less area, but he has to get the appropriate area. So, do that. What can be done is just join this point BC first, just join it. And then, if you can draw a parallel line, it's parallel to uh, CA. So, draw, let's assume E is not drawn, draw DE parallel to CA. That is what we have to do. That's not, not this, draw DE parallel to A. So if you draw this, that is parallel to A. Then if you know now these are parallel lines, and if AC is the common base, right? We can assume that we can say that area of this triangle ABC will be equal to area of EC. ABC will be equal to area of BC. Correct? And if from this we subtract the common area of minus AOC. So what you get? Area of ABC minus AOC is what? 
Dios mismo. Tú y yo. Y, y si sí, imaginas, es como dije, y yo creo que Correct. That can be achieved easily. Why? How? So to do this, first he has to draw a line between A and C. Okay. And then a line parallel to AC from D. And there is a line from straight line from AB and it will hit this point E. So with this you have to determine this E. This has to be determined. Right? Because if E is on the left hand side, the form will get more area. If he is on the right hand side, the form will get less area. But now, using the property of parallelogram and triangle area, we can actually determine, help this farmer determine what is the correct point E so that his new land is triangular and he is not losing any area. And the village is also happy to get this health care facility done. Okay. So, this is a good application of the concepts we have studied. ABCD is a trapezium. So, it's not ABCD. With AB parallel and DC, a line parallel to AC intersect AB at X and Y. This line is parallel to AC. So we draw the lines. And you can see that these two lines are parallel. Okay? To that ADX, ADX, and ACY both have the same medium. So first, let's do ADX and then AC. So we will prove that it is the same area. See, the only thing we know is that these two lines are parallel and these two lines are parallel. Okay, let's apply the theorem, whatever we know, and then we can see if we can solve it. Since these two lines are parallel and we have ADX in question here, we can say that area of ADX, ADX will be equal to area of AXC right ADX because AX is common right so we call this AXC correct now if we talk about these ACY so ACY is the AC A, A, C, Y, and this triangle can we see if it is similar to A, C, X? Yes, it is actually. So if A, C is the common base, you can see that we should try. They have a common base AC. So area AC X is equal to area AC Y. Okay? Where AC is common. AC is common base, these two are parallel, XY is parallel to AC. So AC X and AC Y are the same. Notice here, same base, P2 triangle will be same. If we add the compare these two equations, area of ADX will be equal to area of AC. And that is what we have to do. Okay. Here AP is parallel to BQ, is parallel to CRQ. If we prove that ACQ a C Q is equal to E B R. These three are parallels, right? 
we have to prove that A C Q and P B R. Can we split this? And we prove that this triangle is actually area is same as this triangle. Okay. Can we split this triangle into two parts? Let's take this triangle first. Okay. So we'll see that area of triangle A B Q will be equal to area of triangle this P B Q. Why? Same base, P U is a common base, and they have same parallel. Similarly, area of this triangle is B to C will be equal to area of area of B to R. Same base B Q, same parallel. C R is parallel to B Q. So if we add these two, area of a B Q plus area of B Q C is equal to one. A C Q. Similarly, area of P P B Q plus area of P B Q R will be what? Area of P B R. And that's what we have to do. Okay. The diagonal AC and BD of the quadrilateral ABCD intersects. So the diagonal AC and BD of these quadrilateral intersect at point O such that area of AOD is equal to area of BOC. One is equal to two. Given area of one is equal to area of two. Right? To prove A, to prove A B C D is a trapezium, and to prove A B is parallel to C. Right? If one is equal to two given, let's add the three here. From this equation, will be area of one plus area of three is equal to what? Area of two plus area of three. And with that, we can say that area of triangle A D C. Is equal to area of triangle BDC. Now they are in the same base. These two triangles in the same base and same area. That means AB is parallel to BC. Converse theorem. Okay. Let's take the last numerical chapter. Area of DRC is equal to DBC. DRC, where is DRC? DRC into DPC. Okay. And area of this is equal to corresponding to this. BPD. BPD is equal to ARC. Okay. This is also this. These two are corresponding to this. Right, that is equal to subtraction and also be equal. We have to prove that both the coordinates A, B, C, D and B, P, R, C is that is trapezium. Uh, Pretty easy actually. See, this first condition is given. From the first only we can make out that D, C is the common base. So we can say that R, P is parallel to D, C. Right? From first only. Second statement is given. Second will subtract. We can subtract this triangle from this and this triangle from this. We can make say that ADC is area of ADC is equal to area of BDC. So with that we can say that DC is parallel to AB. Right? Why? Area of ARC minus BRC. So both these equations are given we have subtracted. With this, we can say that all these three lines are parallel. The three lines are parallel. I mean, we take any coordinate of ABCD is a trapezium because AB is parallel to CD, and DCPR is also trapezium because DC is parallel to AI. Okay. 
Let's do a quick summary of whatever we have learned. So we have seen that the area of figure is nothing but a number in some units and that is associated with the part of the plane enclosed by that figure. Two congruent figures will always have equal area but the converse is not true. See that. The parallelograms of the same base, they are two parallelograms of the same base or equal base and if they are between the same parallels, they have an equal in area. Same thing is true with triangle also. Area of parallelogram is nothing but the product of base into its corresponding altitude. And parallelogram on the same base or equal base having the equal area lies within the same parallels. So this is the convert, these two are converts of each. Right? If the parallelogram and the triangles are on the same base and within the same parallel, then we have seen that the area of triangle is half of the area of parallelogram. Triangles on the same base or equal bases and within the same parallels are equal in area. And area of triangle is half into product base into lines. And the triangle on the same base and having equal area lie within the same parallel. So these two are also converse of each other. And the median of the triangle will actually divide the triangle into two parts. So the median here, this will actually. Thank you. Visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality education videos. You can also attempt free online tests that are there in our website. You can also get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website. Thanks a lot.